Dean Lewin Sanders is an American football coach and former professional player who is the head football coach at the University of Colorado Boulder. Nicknamed Prime Time or Coach Prime, during his coaching career, he played in the National Football League NFL for 14 seasons with the Atlanta Falcons, San Francisco 49ers, Dallas Cowboys, Washington Redskins, and Baltimore Ravens. After retiring as a player, Sanders pursued a sports analyst and coaching career. He served as the head football coach at the Jackson State University from 2020 to 2022, after earning his degree at Talladega College in an accelerated program, leading the team to two consecutive Celebration Bowl appearances and the first undefeated regular season in school history. Near the end of the 2022 season, Sanders was named the head football coach at the University of Colorado Boulder. Early Life Sanders was born on August 9, 1967 in Fort Myers, Florida. His parents divorced when Sanders was two years old. He attended North Fort Myers High School and was a letterman and All-State honoree in football, basketball, and baseball. Accepting Challenges Sanders didn't start his coaching career at a traditional football powerhouse. He took on the challenge of coaching at Jackson State University, a historically black college with a rich football history but relatively lower visibility compared to larger programs. This demonstrated his willingness to take on difficult assignments and build a program from the ground up. Passion for Coaching Dean Sanders' journey into coaching began with a deep passion for football and a desire to impart his knowledge and experience to the next generation of players. His love for the game was evident throughout his playing career, and it continued to burn brightly as he transitioned into coaching. Coaching Career Dean Sanders, known as Prime Time during his Hall of Fame playing career and has since transitioned into Coach Prime, has been named the 28th full-time head football coach at the University of Colorado. Sanders was named the 21st head coach in Jackson State history on September 21, 2020, but had to wait to coach his first game until COVID-19 restrictions were lifted and several FCS schools opted to play a delayed schedule in the spring. Exactly six months to the day later February 21, 2021, he led the Tigers to a 53-0 win over Edward Waters, flat, to begin the Coach Prime era. It was considered the touchpoint of the elevation of GSU football and the university into becoming one of the most impactful and recognizable brands nationwide. JSU was 4-3 in the pandemic-delayed 2020 season before rolling to an 11-2 record in 2021, winning the s c title with a 27-10 win over Prairie View A and M in the title game. The Tigers lost to South Carolina State in the Celebration Bowl. Otherwise, their only other loss over his last 25 games was a 12-7 setback at FBS Louisiana Monroe in September 21. Seven of his players on the 2021 JSU roster earned a professional opportunity in the NFL, CFL, or USFL, including James Houston Four, who was drafted in the sixth round by the Detroit Lions. He also signed cornerback Travis Hunter, considered the top high school prospect in the nation, to an NLI in December 2021, the highest-ranked prospect to ever sign with an HBQ or an FCS program. Sanders was recently voted the SWAC's Coach of the Year for a second straight season. Twelve of his players earned some level of all SWAC honors. For the 2021 campaign, he also garnered honors for the FCS Eddie Robinson National Coach of the Year, Fox Toro National Coach of the Year, and Black College Hall of Fame Coach of the Year. Prior to joining the collegiate coaching ranks at Jackson State, Sanders had been involved in coaching for over a decade. He was the offensive coordinator at Trinity Christian School, Cedar Hill, Texas, leading the Tigers to three straight Texas Association of Private and Parochial Schools, TAPPS titles and a 42-3 record. He also has also been part of the coaching staff for the annual Under Armour All-America game since 2012. Last February, Sanders was named as an HBCU legacy coach for the NFL Pro Bowl. Continued Learning Sanders didn't rest on his laurels. He continued to learn and adapt as a coach, attending coaching clinics, studying the game, and seeking advice from experienced mentors. Despite conducting the biggest off-season house cleaning in the modern era of major college football, the Colorado football team isn't supposed to be very good this year under new head coach Dean Sanders. The Buffaloes have too many unknown elements and a schedule that is too difficult, 
according to oddsmakers and other experts. But there is a way they could be wrong, and Sanders could be. The turnaround for a Colorado team that went 1-11 last season is happening at lightning speed. Santa don't have time. He's got to deliver the gifts. He ain't got time to enjoy his cookies. That's all he gets. Sanders said Tuesday as the 18th-ranked Buffaloes 2-0 prepared to host rival Colorado State's 0-1 this weekend. I've had to keep it going. I've got to keep this machine going and make sure we stay on the right path and make sure we're locked in and we're focused on the right things. It's a lot driving this train. It's not easy. Deaton Sanders' rise to becoming a great college coach can be attributed to his passion, networking, Willingness to accept challenges, recruiting skills, player development focus, on-field success, media presence, support from the university, commitment to learning, and his role as an inspirational figure. His coaching career at Jackson State University is a testament to his ability to make a significant impact in the world of college football. That's it for today's video. Make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel. See you in the next video.